up here at Mainfall, there's two potholes. I have lots and lots of videos on the potholes here at Ohio Paul. And two of them, we'll see how visible they are today. Oh, look, we got some geese. Wonder what they do. Wonder if they're eating little fish or something. Oh, look, we got animals here. I just saw the animal duck in behind that log. Maybe it's a ground squirrel. Maybe it was a, a goose. Okay, a high pile, 29 January 2021. We've arrived at Main Falls, having parked and walked from the Ferncliff parking lot. I like that parking lot because that allows you to get this one off your list. And it also lets you get the high bridge. Apparently those big boulders that are covered in snow there, they cracked off, I don't know how many tens of thousands or even longer ago. The other thing, at the visitor center, the expert lady named Barbara Wallace, who appears in the videos for Ohio Pile, she is a, just a gold mine of every all the details and maps and geological stuff for the whole park. I don't even know all that stuff, but apparently the level of these falls, if you were to take this level and go all the way to Cucumber Falls, where Cucumber Falls goes over its lip, is at the same elevation as this thing right here. I think that's what she said. And Cucumber Falls is, uh, I don't know, I guess it's probably about a mile down river to be on the left. I've taken a few videos of kayakers going over the falls. They get a permit and they go over the falls. It's not a big deal. Super expert kayakers. This is all nothing for them. On high water, it almost comes to the top of those big boulders there. And those boulders that are on the other side of the falls are almost covered in water. There's such a mass of water coming down here. That whole area down there, and then that tree by that boulder, and then that big ledge over there, that's Lookout. That's the Lookout Falls ledge. Another thing that's really nice to see in the snow is back up there, Back up there, on the on the ridge up there, there's the foundation scooped out of an old house. And when you walk around it in the snow, it looks almost like a like a little volcano because you're at the, the one of the highest points right up there. And there was a little cabin up there, and the foundation for it is dug out, and it goes down about four to six feet. So, Main Falls, let's go see if we can see the potholes here. Probably too much snow to see the potholes. And for sure it's frozen over. This is the one pothole that almost looks man-made. One's for sure man-made, the other one might be natural.
right here are these little ponds right here totally frozen over but in summer there's a snake family that works these ponds and you'll see the snakes eating the tadpoles okay so I think that is one of the potholes right here That's it right there. Totally frozen over. Well, that's good. Maybe this is it. Yeah, here's the pothole right here. Here's the frozen cone of the... Uh, you can see parts of the pothole there. See this edge right here? You can see the edge of the pothole right there. So this is one of the potholes. Frozen over today. The other one's right over there. This is Main Falls, Ohio Falls State Park, Ferncliff uh, Trail as it comes past Main Falls. Okay, the other pothole is right in here somewhere. Let's make a circle. It's way under. It's way underwater. It's right in there. So there's a pothole. There's a pothole over there. I have no idea how many thousands and tens of thousands of years ago those potholes were made. And they've hung in there all these years. Okay, let's go over to the lookout ledge real quick and then that'll be it for the big four. We've seen all four of the big four today. And it just shows you can come even on a cold day like today. I highly recommend you get these cleats. They're definitely the a winner. You can walk on the snow and ice without slipping. And you can enjoy the snow and the ice and Incredible beauty in the winter here. Well, how, Paul? You can hike all year long. Okay, we're at the Main Falls Overlook. This is a good little tourist thing. Definitely got to be cautious. There's no railings. Just like the Main Falls itself, no railings. It's another reason to get cleats. I thought about being like one of those little vendors. Shows up with your little vending cart on snowy days. I have a little sign that says, don't be put off by the snow and ice. Get your cleats here and sell cleats.